More on this smoke from a distant fire, KPX 5's Kit Doe joins us live from the Oakland Hills. Kit? Yeah, surprisingly, there is not a spare the air alert today. There's just an air quality advisory. And that's because as all that smoke drifts towards the Bay Area, the finer particulates, the stuff that gets really deep into your lungs and causes problems, all that has dissipated into the upper atmosphere. And what's left are the larger chunks of relatively safer ash that has come raining down on the Bay Area. No, it's not the apocalypse. It's just an ash plume making for a surreal Sunday in the Bay. Smoke from the county and Pawnee fire is actually drifting 60 to 70 miles to the southwest. Satellite imagery shows prevailing winds are blowing it straight into the north and east bay. In Vallejo, neighbors woke up to flakes of ash deposited onto their cars overnight. It was especially thick in Berkeley. Look closely and you can see the chunks floating by. In the Oakland Hills, this time-lapse video of falling ash on a car windshield is 40 minutes condensed down to about 7 seconds. And yes, social media lit up with posts about raining ash comparing it to snowfall. Right now we're sort of in that that perfect environment for them to be transported in into at least the northern half of the Bay Area. But it's a fairly broad swath going from the uh, the North Bay down into the middle port portion of the Bay Area. Jan Knoll with Golden Gate Weather Services says the ash is affecting the color of the sky. In Marin, the sunrise this morning was especially orange. Across the Bay Bridge, no, that's not some sepia Instagram filter. That's really how it looked. And near the Embarcadero, yellow fog. The particle size is larger than like the small sizes we see that give us the blue skies. When we get larger particles, we start filtering out the shorter wavelengths of light so that all that's left are in the reds, oranges, and yellows. On Ashby Avenue, if you're eating outside, good luck with that. And no, that's not dandruff. For UC Berkeley physics student Graham Woolley, waking up to the falling ash was startling. When I saw it snowing down, I thought it was pretty close to us. I thought it, it might just be up in the hills. His mother, Glenda Campos, is a spiritual director in Southern California. Things will happen and I can't change them. There's no way I can change them. They're outside of my control. So if I'm feeling anxiety or worry about them, I'll say I let go of my desire to change the situation. And we are starting to see some relief already in the past couple of hours. The amount of ash falling here in the Oakland Hills has decreased dramatically. It looks like the forecast is calling for winds to shift and blow all that smoke and ash into the Central Valley starting tomorrow. We're live in the Oakland Hills. Kit Doe, KPIX5. Well